welcome to Tarot Card Tuesday. I am your hostess of Blue-Eyed Priestess. Today's Tarot Card Tuesday is from April 21st until April 28th. I want to give a quick shout out to all the Tauruses. Sun moves into the astrological sign of the bull. So happy birthday, y'all. It's your time to shine. So here we go. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Pick the card that you feel connected to the most. For those of you that have chosen card number one, you have chosen the Four of Pentacles. So let's take a look at this card. As you can see, there's pentacles, four of them, illustrated on the card, and in between his hands is a pentacle. And what that means is to hold on to your money. Pentacles represent our finances. Um, right now, there may have been some of us that have gotten our stimulus check back, so we're trying to figure out, hmm, what can we buy? We're shopping online because, you know, retail therapy is a real thing. Um, but for advice for this card is not to shop, not to spend money on anything that is not necessary. So if you are planning a big purchase, it's better to hold off right now. The second meaning of this card has to do with our attitude at home. And this card means that things are my way. It can be kind of a very rigid way of operating within your household. Like things need to be done this way, being kind of strict. Um, but you know, right now a lot of us might need help on the home front. So we have to learn how to delegate. And what that means is we might have to trade off things being done our way in order to get things done in the house. So this has to do with delegating to other people. Let other people help you. And like I said before, it may not be done, especially to your liking, but that would, that is what needs to happen right now. If you pick the second card, then you pick the Ace of Wands. Anytime you see an Ace in the Tarot, it is all about new beginnings. So the Ace of Wands specifically speaks to new projects, new ventures, new passions, new goals. Um, and specifically, it does very well with writing endeavors and anything that has to do with creating. So this is kind of a time of planning. Um, typically in the Tarot, for the Ace of Wands, it has to do with autumn. So maybe it has to do with planning some type of event or goals that will be fulfilled when it comes to the fall of this year. So obviously right now we're in a period where a lot of us are in a standstill and maybe we're making future plans for that time of year. So that's kind of what the advice is here is to number one, start thinking specifically about what new projects that you can do that you will feel passionate about and enthusiastic about. Um, and the other thing is, are those endeavors creating or writing? Have you always wanted to write that book or even keep a journal? But what it is, is thinking about new projects that can kind of bring you fulfillment and the joy that you seek. It's all about new goals at this time, which corresponds with Wednesday's new moon in Taurus. A new moon is always time to plant seeds. So what do you want to plant that you want to harvest in the fall? Is there something that you can start right now, a project that possibly you can start that you will reap the rewards? So that can go even as far as a workout routine or eating right, or maybe there is some project that you want to do now that you will feel more prepared for later in the year. So if you've picked card number three, then you've picked the moon. Let's take a look at the moon. So the moon has dogs and are they barking at the sun or are they barking at the moon? You can't really tell what exactly that they're barking at. And if you look below, you see the water. So this has to do with our emotions and not being very sure of how we feel about things. So in the upcoming week, it's really important to pay attention to what you are consuming. So this can be a card of addiction. And addiction is like so multifaceted when it comes to what that means. Some of us, we get addicted to TV because we can tune out all of our emotions and things that are happening. Some of us, it's sugar. Some of us, it's alcohol. Whatever those things are, this card is to be really conscious about what you're consuming this week. So that means, what are you watching on TV? What are you drinking? What are you eating? And it has to do with situations that may not feel right. So take a look within yourself and with those around you and just make sure that we're not overdoing it. A lot of us right now don't have a lot of structure. So you could be drinking a beer at two o'clock in the afternoon when you're normally working. And maybe you don't drink on Tuesdays. You only drink on the weekends, but now you're drinking every night because, hey, that's what you're doing. So advice for this is to really be cautious of that and don't overdo it when it comes to addictions. Thank you all for tuning in to today's Tarot Card Tuesday. I hope to see you next week. Bye-bye. <music>